Gleason torments his former teammates at Old Trafford. Two days after the disappointment of a semi-final defeat by Hampshire in the One Day Cup, Lancashire resumed their county championship campaign against a North Ant side still looking for their first win of the season in the competition. The host without James Anderson, who sustained a knee injury in that game on Sunday. A huge blow after his six-wicket haul helped them beat Middlesex in round two. Despite the absence of their talisman, Lancashire won the toss and elected to bowl in perfect conditions at Old Trafford. But they struggled to make an early impression, with North Ants openers Vasconcelos and Newton settling in nicely, 30 without loss after 10 overs. But that serene start was interrupted when Newton picked up an injury and had to call for a runner. And soon after Vasconcelos edged Richard Gleeson, and after checking with keeper Dane Villas, the opener walked, North Ants 38 for 1. And Gleeson soon struck again on his return from injury and against his former county. Vilas taking another catch to remove skipper Alex Wakeley for just two. That brought Temba Bafuma to the crease for his championship debut for North Ants, and the South African steered his side out of danger and threw to lunch with no further loss of wickets. 80 for two at the interval, the visitors with the slightest upper hand. Lancashire needing more of the same from Gleeson in the afternoon session. And the pace man obliged, removing Newton in his first over after lunch, LVW for 32. A tight contest was soon turning the home side's way. Northants had just passed three figures when Keogh was also trapped in front. Gleeson was now having a day to remember with figures of four for 28. And the momentum of the game had completely changed in the next over when JJ Cobb fell second ball to Bailey thanks to a great catch by Rob Jones. Bavuma needed someone to stay with him and Luke Proctor looked up to the task, but the visitors' plight soon worsened. Bavuma adjudged LBW to Onions for 39, 119 for 6. North Ant's loan signing Luke Wood joined Proctor at the crease, and the pair set about repairing the damage. Proctor was particularly inspired against his former county and played the lead role in a stand that was finally broken by that man Gleason just before tea. Jennings taking the catch to remove Proctor for 48. North Ants 190 for 7 at the break, thanks largely to that stand of 70 between Proctor and Wood. With five wickets in the afternoon, Lancashire well on top. And the home team's advantage quickly grew in the evening session as Onions took two quick wickets. Jamie Overton LBW for 6 on his North Ants debut before Buck was bowled for a duck three balls later. The end of the innings was nigh, but Wood didn't go quietly. A few more lusty blows from the low knee before he became Onion's fourth victim, out for 66. North Ants all out for 230, tormented by their former player, Gleeson taking his first Fifer for Lancashire on his first appearance of the season. The home side's reply didn't reach stumps unscathed. Hamid made a century in his last championship game, but no repeat this time, caught behind off Sanderson for seven. Jennings and Burns saw Lancashire through to the close, 29 for one, just 201 runs behind, and surely well placed on an Old Trafford wicket that's bound to get easier for batting. <laughs>